was mine because I expect to see it. And I'm wearing a shirt here. And so guys, um, I want to show you guys some cool stuff. Uh, let me get something. Oh, oh. Well, I need mean, the plate first. Um, let me get, um, tell you guys, I'm going to be doing a science fair project for my school again. Um, I was really having my friend over here, a little known as the Cheeseburger King, uh, put his, um, thing in the description below. I'm probably going to have him edit around with this one. Um, but, yeah, I'm probably going to end up having this to be shown in class as well, so it sucks. Probably might hear some stuff in the background, but I won't let that bother us. Um, I'm going to be showing you guys the project that me and Nova decided to call Rainbow Milk. Um, probably I'm like, what? That doesn't even make sense. Um, it does because it involves color changing milk. But so let me grab the camera here to show you. It's that. Well, it's quite, quite cool. Um, we're going to be showing you, um, how this actually works. Pretty much, first of all, you're going to need, uh, well, I'm using a cup at least because, you know, uh, I don't want no spills, no nothing. I'm filling the cup with the milk because you can use any type of milk, even probably chalk milk. I'm not sure. That's what Opa's doing. I'm um, doing just because what we're trying to do is that we're seeing which type of milk works the best when it comes to this. So what you want to do is really first of all fill the entire plate with the milk. So yeah, just grab a camera here. So after you fill the entire thing with the milk, um, what you want to do is you want to take four different colors of food coloring and put it down so I can take off the cap. And then you just want to place it around in the middle right here, like that. And just do that with each of the colors, which I'm using red, blue, and green. Um, hopefully, you guys find this cool. This is a small tutorial form of it, I guess. So I was doing this my little sister. And then after you put the colors, what you want to do is you want to take a a little cotton swab or ear cleaner, I guess is the way you call it. And then you take dish or your soap and you put it on the tip of it. You put the dish washing soap on the tip of it like I did. And then you just take it and you put it down in the middle and it looks real cool. Look. So yeah, that's how you do that. It's I honestly find it pretty cool. You guys want to try this out for yourself? It's it's pretty cool. So yeah, I'm gonna be doing this for a science for project. So you guys might end up seeing this around somewhere else. And you know, so yeah, guys, that's that's pretty much it. And that's how that one turned out. My little sister did that one. And so yeah, yes. My name is Hawkins Fasse. Welcome to No Interruptions. And I will talk to you guys later. Okay, good. Bye. Let me press the button. Bye.